Hello, users, and welcome to another episodic installation of Above It All. This is a series in where my lips are chapped because I was knocking on doors all weekend and I forgot chapstick, my biggest regret, and I have to say this in the intro to every video so that you know that my lips are chapped for a good reason, uh, because I helped Bernie get more votes than he did in uh, 2016 in South Carolina. And I saw this. I saw this on election night and I saved it because I knew I wanted to make a video when I got home. Ugh. 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 Like, I, these noises are, they exemplify my disdain, my disappointment, and other words that start with dis. Um, and I'm just going to play this clip and then I've got another clip and, uh, and we'll go from there. This, this clip is super low. I'm so sorry. People often will tell me like, oh, you know, your clips are super low. Yeah, turn the volume. Please turn your volume up. I'm going to not talk. It's 16 seconds. It's not my fault, okay? Okay, so I got the sticker in the mail. I wanted to uh to show it. Um Oh. It's it's first of all, it's a duh. We already knew this. If you've been following my channel, you've already known this, hopefully. Um but this is one of those things where there's still people out there that don't pay attention to Twitter. They're not on Twitter. They don't understand the minutiae. They go like, "Oh, Elizabeth Warren. I uh I remember her and uh you know, she's cool and she's a woman. She's got like she's still her entire campaign is just based around siphoning support from Bernard and it's ridiculous it's cringy it's dumb it's disgusting it is filthy and even worse she just started to go after him this is like her concession speech I suppose if you can even call it that because we already knew she was going to lose to begin with but this is her speech after South Carolina demands more than a senator who has good ideas but whose 30-year track record shows he consistently calls for things that fail to get done and consistently opposing things that nevertheless he fails to stop. Oh, I fucking hate her. I seriously, like, it's hard to not be a fucking toxic Bernie bro right now, but I fucking hate this lying fucking witch, dude. The fucking Amazon workers getting $15 an hour. Sure, Amazon tried to pull some stock shit, but that's okay because they got fucking raises. And then you've got Disney workers, $15 an hour. He passed the War Powers Act for the first time ever to stop genociding small children in fucking Yemen. This lie, this lie is literally costing people millions of people their lives their security and their fucking their their lost wages that are stolen from billionaires this is just disgusting it is disgusting i mm, i fucking hate her i hate her like this is something like i've had to all weekend be nice and knock on doors and i like someone said like oh i support i like elizabeth and she's okay you have to be nice to these people and i've had this stirring around it's like i fucking hate her she is disgusting she is evil she is just the 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 physical embodiment of pure manifestation of nefarious greed narcissism and disgust i despise elizabeth warren and you can quote me on that i will let you quote me on that i despise elizabeth warren and this is my response to Elizabeth Warren. I got this selected and this is cued and this is what I this is what I think of when I hear this fucking oh I believe these me warn I love this and little bit let me warn the nation against the smooth evasion that says of course we believe these things we believe in social security we believe in work for the unemployed. We believe in saving homes. Cross our hearts and hope to die. We believe in all these things. But we do not like the way the present administration is doing them. Just turn them over to us. We will do all of them. We will do more of them, we will do them better, and most important of all, the doing of them will not cost 
anybody anything. Exactly. Exactly. That's the whole fucking point. Elizabeth Warren is in this campaign to cripple Bernie Sanders. She is not progressive. She is a literal scumbag. And again, you can quote me on this. Anybody, and I mean anybody, who is in a position of power, and they use that position of power to inflict suffering and pain on those that just have no other options. They're just, they're down. They're, they're, they're lonely. They're, they're taken advantage of every day by the system that we we live in and if you someone who's a senator a presidential candidate are basing your entire game plan and strategy on just making these people suffer just a little bit longer just a little bit longer just maybe they'll lose their house maybe maybe oh what if these people you know they don't have enough money to hold on for a little bit longer they're going to lose their house they're going to lose their car they're going to lose their job they're going to lose their insurance they're going to lose their children but that's okay because when I'm president, and that's it. That's it. Because she has no fucking plan for anything. All she wants to do is stifle the only movement in this, in this primary that's actually capable and that actually wants to help people. And while she, she meanwhile, she says, oh, we believe these things. We believe in housing for the homeless. We believe in jobs for the jobs le- jobless, but uh, you got to let me do it. You got to let me do it because I've got a plan. Oh, I've got a plan. No. Fuck Elizabeth Warren. Shh, mm, I, mm, I fucking hate her. <sighs> now that Mayor Pete's dropped out, I hate her the most. I fucking hate her. I could make a video that's like 10 minutes long of me saying, I fucking hate Elizabeth Warren over and over again. I fucking hate Elizabeth Warren. Like, there is nothing you can say to me at this point in human history. Maybe like three years from now, if she does a complete 180 from like tomorrow onward, maybe, right? But I I fucking hate her. I fucking hate her. She is a lying, selfish, nefarious, scumbag, disgusting human. Oh, fuck. I'm going to be like 70 years old one day, and I'm going to talk. I'm going to tell my grandkids, like, you know who I fucking hate? Elizabeth fucking Warren. And they're going to say, who? And then that I'm just going to get a smile on my face. Mm-mm-mm. Damn right who. I can't smile because my lips are tra- chapped, and it, it really hurts to actually smile. Uh, I should have brought chapstick. Um, next time I'll bring chapstick. I'm so sorry that uh, I'm doing this, but uh, I need to turn this video off. Otherwise, I'm going to say things that I, you shouldn't quote me on uh, because I'm going to turn the video off so you can't quote me. So, um, I fucking hate her. I hate her 